Hey guys, Cal Torak here. Today, I want to quickly talk about what I'm doing to last minute prepare for phase three and my plans for leveling 40 to 50. Been getting these questions a lot, so I figured I'd make a video going over it. We only got five days until launch, so you really gotta scramble. For those that don't know, I'll be live streaming the launch of phase three on this channel. I'll be rushing for 50 as fast as I can. So if you are around, come hang out on launch day. Now let's get started. Since everyone wants to know how I want to level, here is my current launch plan. I am doing a pre-quest turn-in route that is hopefully going to get me close to level 43 when all is said and done. I'll have a list of multiple pre-quest guides down below. Choose whichever one is best for you. Pre-questing is important for my route because I want to do ZF as fast as possible. My current pre-quest route has me estimated to hit 42.5, but some pre-quest routes have people hitting 44. Choose whichever you want to do. It takes a serious time investment getting all of these quests done. After my pre-questing, I'll be going into Nomer with my guild. BFD ended up giving solid experience last phase, and with the 50% experience buff we got for phase 3, Nomer should be fantastic experience. My guild's planning on blasting Nomer after we pre-quest, which should get me well into 43. Now you can start ZF at 40, but it really starts becoming good XP per hour around 43 or 44. So that's why I'm aiming for at least 43 before swapping to ZF Graveyard. If I don't hit 43, I'm still going to go to Graveyard after Nomer, but yeah. Once I'm at ZF, I'll be staying there all the way to level 50. If you are new to the ZF Graveyard farm, there are plenty of videos on YouTube you can look up. Come launch day, I should be posting a video of me clearing ZF as well. So stay tuned for that. Okay, so that's my leveling route. For my prep for Phase 3, it's pretty simple since we weren't really given much of a heads up. If you haven't already started your prep weeks in advance, you are basically out of time. We got 5 days left in the phase, so what last minute things can you do? Outside of pre-questing, here's what I'm currently working on. I want to get enough honor for at least rank 7 for the level 50 PvP set. This will require 110,000 honor, so I am banking as many honor tokens from the Blood Moon PvP event as possible. For me, specifically the shoulders are super appealing. I'm hitting Blood Moon every chance I can get. I am also still in need of the Arathi Basin Exalt, but that's super low priority for me. This next one is simple, but farming gold is something I need to do. I just finished twinking out a few of my alts with professions and gear, so I'm pretty broke. I'm going to be selling lots of Kath and Ulda boosts over the next few days to replenish my gold. Ideally I want to be going into the phase with over 500 gold, but I should be making a boatload leveling in ZF. I'll be leveling my Mage, Paladin, and Hunter there. So while I do need gold for launch, I'll definitely be making plenty leveling in ZF. The last thing I'll be doing before launch is stockpiling consumes. I want plenty of consumes for the ZF graveyard farm initially. I want to make those first few levels as efficient as possible. ZF farm is pretty easy, and eventually you'll be clearing it in less than 10 minutes. But at first it'll be slow and a little painful. Having a bunch of mana and invis pots in your bank will make ZF leveling way easier. There's a bank and gadget, so you can easily scoop your consumes between runs. And that's really it for my last minute prep list. It's unfortunate we weren't given much of a heads up for this phase dropping, but hey, I'm super excited. I can't wait to dive into phase 3 and start finding all the new runes. I'll be providing coverage for all the mage phase 3 runes on this channel, so make sure to subscribe if you haven't. Like this video if you found it helpful. Take care and enjoy phase 3.